Hello friends, welcome to my channel Maths Pursuit. We will continue our journey with real numbers. This time we are going to look into question number 3 of exercise 1.1. Let's see what we have in question number 3. An army contingent of 616 members is to march behind an army band of 32 members in a parade. The two groups are to march in the same number of columns. What is the maximum number of columns in which they can march? That means we need to find out the maximum number of columns these two groups will occupy. Let's see how we can solve this question. Uh, let's put this question uh, in this manner. Like let us first identify what are the things given in the question and then we will see how we can resolve this. So we have like number of members in the army contingent is equal to 616. Number of members in the army band is equal to 32. In order to find the maximum number of columns, we need to find the edge shape of the two numbers. That is 6, 1, 6 and 32. This is quite evident. Like uh, SCF is the highest common factor. For that reason, we are going to find out the SCF so that we can find out the maximum number of columns uh, that we need to identify as per the question. And now coming uh, to this particular uh, chapter like again we are going to uh, put Euclid's division lemma to find out the highest common factor. So let's see. Now as we, we know that uh, 616 uh, that uh, out of 616 and 32, 616 is the uh, bigger number or greater number. So we will divide 616 with 32 and we will continue this division uh, till we get the remainder as 0. So after dividing 616 with 32, we are getting a remainder of 8. Now again dividing the previous divisor 32 with our new remainder 8, we are getting here as a remainder 0. We very well know that once we get the remainder 0, our calculation stops and the divisor of this particular line is our answer. So HCF of 616 and 32 is the divisor of the last line that is 8. Now, hence, we can easily say that the maximum number of columns in which the army band or the army members can parade is 8 columns. Hope guys, you uh, understood this calculation. If you have any doubts or concerns, kindly write to me in the comment section of this video. Definitely, I will get back to you once I see the comments. If you really like my video, kindly subscribe and share with your friends. Thank you. Bye.